Hi, I'm Naomi. I'm a First Nations bead artist and educator from Neoshinaming, Ontario. I create contemporary examples of woodlands and northeastern style beadwork based on older examples. My one main objective is to ensure that our Indigenous arts live on. And one of the ways that I do that is I create contemporary pieces and I also um, pass along the knowledge to others uh, through teaching workshops. And adornment and beads are very important to us as First Nations people. It tells a story about who we are. So beaded elements such as the cuff that I'm wearing, um, pendants where I combine the moose hair with the beadwork, quill work with beadwork are all based on our traditional art forms. This particular piece here is almost 200 years old. It is from this region, likely of Haudenosaunee or Iroquois origins. And these are the sorts of things that influence my contemporary work now. When you look at this purse that I've been working on, this is the front of it, this is the back of it. I still have more work to do on it. But you can see how I'm using the older motifs to create something that's modern and relevant now. In this showcase here is an example of a bunch of older strawberries. The name Strawberry Pincushion is one of our older Victorian art forms where the Native women would make the Strawberry Pincushion for sale to the non-Native women and it actually became one of the first cottage industries of our nation. So it also created a lot of cross-cultural exchange. And this is one of the things that uh, I like to share with people because it's a story that not a lot of people know about. Um, to the Victorian non-native woman, the strawberry was a beautiful thing to have for her sewing basket. But for us, it's also one of our medicine plants. So there was a nice little exchange there between two different uh, cultures. I feel really honored to be part of the Heart and Hand Festival on September 21st, taking place at Schneider House. I think that it's a wonderful opportunity to share my culture and my roots with other people um, and, and be able to indulge in something that I love doing.